Hello everyone and welcome back to Blockhood. Alright, so we are taking on challenge number four today, where we need to produce a hundred fish and a hundred vegetables, and all we have is money. Um so it's gonna take some time to figure out how exactly oh local vegetables, okay. So water community and fertilizer. Necessary there. Fish farm. Water, organic waste, and labor. So let's go ahead and get some electricity going. Let's get some water. Let's get some, some trees. And... Let's get a wetland, because that'll help produce groundwater for us. So now, hopefully, we have what we need to start getting an apartment, because these guys should be producing fresh air, should they not? Oh, well, Marketplace needs vegetables and fish. Okay, but it, it gives a lot of other things. So let's look at our resources. So money is low, but everything else is okay. And we can, a greenhouse, okay. So we cannot build a corner store, which is sad because that's an easy way for us to get money. Um, so we can do a hydroponic farm, but it doesn't seem that, Oh, we need two community. So how do we go about getting community? Okay, wait. Hold up. We need to figure out how to get community, guys. How do we get community? Leisure. The marketplace outputs community. Okay, maybe we should get this, but let's also wait, wait, wait. So that'll give us vegetables, but where do we go for the fish? Because maybe we don't need the community. Um, a fish farm, we need organic waste. Now I believe these produce organic waste. They do. A large apartment produces more organic waste, so let's just... Go ahead and do that. Now we're low on fresh air, money, and leisure. So luckily, we can try and deal with both of those at the same time. So let's make sure everybody's getting what they need. Okay, we're a little low on groundwater. So let's just put in another wetland. Now we might be low on regular water. We're not yet, but we will be soon. So we need to start making some money in order to make everything better, which means we need to get that greenhouse going. So that should help us get... Oh, we need more fertilizer. So we need something that outputs fertilizer that does. Does anything else? Um. Oh, this does. A fish farm. Literally what we need. Alright, we've unlocked farmer. So money is going down, but right now everything seems pretty good. Otherwise. So... Uh, gray water, organic waste, consumers, they're all good. Cause how are we doing on organic waste? We're barely above what we need. So how are we doing on fish? We have four. And we have eight vegetables. Because we could get a market...
like that. Now I think... Oh, everything's actually still fine. Okay, everything's fine. So far. <sighs> but that should... That put our money over the top, so that's great. Um, so let's, let's see. Everybody should have what they need. So everything has what they need. But I don't think our fish is going up. Can I see fish? Is it in here? Fish. Yeah, our fish is very, very slightly going up. Not even really at all. So we have planters that can... So let's just put in another fish farm. So it doesn't synergize by putting them next to each other, but now we're short on organic waste. The quickest way to deal with that is to build another large apartment. Um, we get some synergy there. Now our electricity is barely enough. Um, but before we get like super, super duper de concerned, why can we not access that from there? Oh, probably because there's no access point there. Um, I think we should start preparing to move up in the world. So our electricity is now too low. How's our money? It's okay. It's not great, but we'll deal. So now our electricity should be a-okay. Our money is barely enough. Eesh. Okay. It's not ideal. That much is for sure. But let's see. Can we put in planters for our people? Now, do we actually have any, like, people? Like, I have apartments. There's one farmer. <laughs> We're not really concerned with her happiness right now. Oh, no, our community is low. What outputs community? The market does. I don't even know if we can really afford another market, but we'll see if we can. Okay. This is definitely a more challenging challenge than the others so far, but that's fine. This is what we wanted, right? We wanted to start actually having to build more in our hood. So our community is just barely enough now. So the planter really hurt the community. I mean, it's, it's good for the community. It didn't hurt the community, but... Um, maybe an algae farm? Because we're producing quite a bit of gray water. And so if we do that, we can get rid of some of the gray water and turn it in. Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. The, the fish farms are not happy. Why are they not happy? They're not getting organic waste. Okay, so we need, we need more organic waste, which is not something you would think you would need, but we do. So let's just put that there. Now I'm curious... Can I see... So this one's not accessible. Why? Now it is. This is why we should check these things. We probably would have been fine without the, the next set. So leisure's low. So we need to start building our second floor. Okay, so we can't build over a windmill. Kind of makes sense. At least not immediately. So we need more leisure. Which all that really means is we just need more trees, right? So we've got some trees here. Now our groundwater is too small. So can we put in a sprinkler? Were we allowed to? Yes. Yes we are. Great. I'd like to put it right here. I'm starting to get a hang of the building thing a little bit. Sort of. Admittedly, not that much. 
Okay, let's just, I want it right here. Because then it should synergize. Okay, nope, it doesn't. That's strange. Groundwater is just barely enough. Community is just barely enough. We're low on fish. So we need another fish farm. What do we need for that? Okay, so we have barely enough fish, but now we have enough, right? Where's fish? Fish. We're barely producing over what we need. So do we put down another? I'm gonna do it anyway. So I mean we're getting we're getting our vegetables. That's not a problem. It's the fish that's the problem. We're not producing anywhere near enough fish. So what happens if I keep doing that? Then our organic waste isn't enough. And if we go here, so wait, let me just, I'm going to get you some organic waste. Don't you even worry your pretty little heads. Who would like to live near the fish farms? Because that's where you're living now. That's not even enough. We need more than that. That's not actually what I wanted to do. Okay. I would like to build a small apartment right here. Please. I apparently can't build it anywhere. I can't build it there. Okay, let's just build it there then, and we'll put a corridor. Oh wait, no, we can't, dang it. We can't put a corridor there. Slowly we're going to learn about where to put things and where not to put things, and everything will eventually be fine. Now we don't have enough electricity, but that's okay. I'm just going to, we're just going to build a small housing circuit right there. And then for electricity... All we can build is windmills. That's great. Why can't I build here? I don't understand. So there. Now we should have plenty of that. Now we don't have enough fresh air or enough water. Or enough leisure. Okay, well, the leisure and the water, uh, the fresh air are easy. So we'll try that. That's going to help a little bit. Oh, no, one of my fish farms decayed. So in its place, let's put a water tower. So now we're just low on fresh air and groundwater and leisure. So, hold up again. We're going to build a third floor. It's facing the wrong way, which is slightly unnerving to me. There we go. Um, so on the third floor, build some corridors. Okay, so you can do two above a windmill, just not one. That's good to know. Um, so we need some fresh air. We need some leisure. And we definitely need some groundwater. How are we on regular water? Not that great. Um, I want it here. Definitely having some issues with the... Uh, with the building, still. So, fresh air is still low. 
so we need a little bit more fresh air. So we have a third floor that's just wilderness for now. We actually have all the fish we need. Somehow that happened. Oh, now we're low on groundwater again. Dang it. Okay, can we build a sprinkler? Okay, just, just, wait, 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 wait. Everything is angry. Everything is angry. It's fine. Please don't get mad. That's not really what I wanted. Okay. Okay, so the apartments do not have what they need. And I just, just want to build this, please. So that should help with the groundwater. So why are the apartments decaying? They're not accessible. So this one cannot be made accessible. So we're just going to have to get rid of it, unfortunately. Oops. Um, so... Now, why are you flashing red? Tell me why. Explain. Okay, did you just need to, like, fix it up and then produce something to stop? I'm gonna guess that's what was necessary. So how are we doing on vegetables? We're barely growing any. We're growing some, but barely any. If I do this, just how screwed are we? Okay, we still seem fine. So that should help with the vegetables. Get us over what we need. Yeah. So let's just speed things along a little bit and get all our vegetables out of the way. But look guys, we actually built like a pretty nice little hood, right? Three stories, lots going on. You've completed challenge four, this is the last of the easy challenges, try the intermediate ones. I believe actually there are two more labeled easy. <laughs> They're just not there with the others. Yeah, these two. So, we definitely still have some easy challenges. I don't know what the game's talking about. These must have been added later. <laughs> um, but I think we will do, try and do the easy ones before moving on to intermediate. But we're going to do those in the next episode. So, if you enjoyed this one, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And as always, I'm the Purple Peggy Sis, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye